Hello everyone, so welcome to my cooking show. Today I'll be showing you how to make a jackfruit smoothie. Jackfruit smoothies are very popular in Vietnamese cuisine. You're bound to find them in the menus of Vietnamese restaurants. So I consider the jackfruit smoothie to be a close cousin of the Vietnamese avocado smoothie. The reason is they both use milk and they both use condensed milk. You just swap the fruits around. So today I'll be making a vegan version of the jackfruit smoothie. I really missed the jackfruit smoothie when I became plant-based and I'm really excited to show you this recipe because I was really excited to find out this recipe. So enjoy guys. The traditional recipe calls for cow's milk but we'll be using soy milk today. Add in the jackfruit, I usually just buy the canned jackfruit and syrup which is much easier. Now add in some ice depending on how thick you want your smoothie to be. Increase the ice if you want it to become more of an icy thick consistency. And now let's blend it up all together. Blend until smooth and creamy. You don't have to completely pulverize it. You can leave chunks of jackfruit and ice to add a bit of a texture to your smoothie. Now add in the condensed milk. Since we're doing a vegan version, I've used my own soy condensed milk, which you can find the recipe to in the description box below. I like to add in the condensed milk last so I can adjust the sweetness to my liking. On some days I feel like a little bit more of sweetness but sometimes I just want to be a bit healthier and I reduce my sugar intake. So definitely feel free to add in more or less of any of the ingredients to your liking. I added some more ice in it because I found that the consistency was a bit too watery. I think I left my initial ice a bit too long out in the freezer because I was doing my introduction and so <laughs> it was a bit thin than I liked. So here you are guys, this is the Vietnamese inspired vegan jackfruit smoothie. So it has soy milk and soy condensed milk in it. It has a thicker consistency than normal smoothies. Um, it's kind of like a milkshake more so, um, but in Vietnamese we like to call it smoothies. So you use a spoon to scoop it out and obviously you can sip on it. I really like this one and the avocado smoothie, so make sure you check it out and make sure you check out my other recipes too. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to my channel. I'd really appreciate it so much. And don't forget to look at my blog. There's a full recipe on this and other recipes as well. And I'd love it if you check that out too. So thank you guys and see you next time. Enjoy.